Hey guys, so Amber Chipman had recommended getting some moss balls for my tank because the angel hair moss was really getting out of control. So I'm here with my cousin and we are gonna go check out our local fish shop for some great deals. What's up y'all? How you doing? <laughs> Hi y'all. We out here getting Jamba Juice. Now we're eating again. It's okay though. You know what? Sometimes girls gotta do what a girls gotta do. You feel me? <laughs> Alright, so we're heading into the aquarium right now. It's really called aquarium. And I've been here before. Um, they're really nice and really helpful. And they have a lot of stuff, so we're just gonna check out what they have for a brackish water tank. Woo! <laughs> and uh, go from there. Look at all the nice corals they have. Oh my god, oh my Finding gosh. Nemo, Finding Nemo. Da -da -da -da. Bam! Hi. <laughs> Featuring Valerie. Oh my god, Val. You should put these in your tank. Um, a dog? Yeah. I don't think so, Val. I don't think so. These guys are so big. These are at least like triple the size of the shrimp I have at home. Oh snap, this one's dying right here. What, where? He's not dying, he's just grabbing stuff from he's the top. He's doing underwater push-ups. I think I might try some red shrimp. shrimp. They look really cute and they get really big. They're really nice fairies. Oh, they're so cute! I think I found the moss balls that I need. I don't know how much they are though, there's no prices on the same. Zanger, who whistling at you? Hold on. Where's your What's in my bag tag? Cassandra. So we just spoke to the nicest representative here. We're at, where are we? JoJo's Aquarium. We decided to stop by a different aquarium place because um, the other one just, usually they're really helpful, but this time we had to like fight to find somebody to help us and um, we only got one thing, so. Um, I'm here and she recommended getting these um, these plants um, for my tank because um, I want to slowly switch to um, a planted tank or start a new planted tank um, but their fish look a lot happier here I mean we saw a lot of dead fish at the other one um, but yeah we got moss balls here too and they're a dollar cheaper I should have came here instead but, um, yep, just looking around. What do you think, Bao Pao? I think that it's amazing here. Thank you. <laughs> Bao! Oh my god, you're following me? Yeah, I'm following you. I'm camera shy. Oh my goodness, Bao Pao. <laughs> okay, so I'm really on board with getting another tank. I've been looking at blue tiger shrimp for a while. Um, and the nice lady here said that the Flugel Nano Shrimp Habitat would work really well. And I really like Flugel, so I actually might consider getting a tank and starting that up. And maybe doing a plan to take it this time. But look at my new shrimp. Look at my new shrimp tank. <laughs> Isn't it cute? Oh, I was covering the speakers. Awkward. Oh my gosh. Okay, so but look at my new shrimp tank. Alright, so I got the Nano Shrimp Habitat, um, the Fugal Ebby, and it comes with a bunch of stuff for the shrimp. I might replace the light because it looks kind of ugly, but I'm going to try a planted tank this time and see how that goes. Yay! Okay, so first what I want to do is, um, I left some food in there, in there. 
right there. Um, and it's just been sitting there for a little bit. They just haven't gotten to it. So I'm just gonna suck that out with this syringe. So there's a lot of nasty stuff in there. It's just broken down food. We're gonna take that out. So I'm just gonna open this up. I have like no nails, so this is really difficult. Bow. Leo, this is not a treat. This is not, no. Somebody's gonna help you open it. He wants to help me open it. Sorry, Leo. Look in there. Oh, look at look at Coco Bear. Just is that what I think it is? They really think they're gonna get a moss ball. Mhm. Mm this is not a treat, Leo. Look how happy he is, though. Oh, Coco's pissed. Coco's pissed. So, um, Amber had recommended to just break this thing up and roll it into smaller balls. So that's what I'm going to try to do. Um, the guy I bought this from said that they are freshwaters and he said they might not survive in freshwater, but, or in brackish water, but um, Amber had sent me some pictures of hers and they looked to be doing pretty well. So. I just ripped up the moss balls and rolled them into smaller balls um, and put them around my tank. So the shrimp have been clinging onto them randomly, but I have a total of four moss balls in my tank. There. And I guess we'll see how they do. I took out all of the angel hair moss because it just got really annoying. There's still some on some of the plants. And they're growing sparingly, but I've just been taking them out every day as I see them. So hopefully they'll be gone soon. But yep. Everything looks good. Alright, thanks Val for spending the day with me. You're welcome!